Are there peas in this? I think those are lentils. No, are... I think they're peas. Oh. <laughs> you called me a... Yeah, I did. Oh, there are peas. Yeah. <laughs> All right, whatever, face, let's go. <laughs> Welcome to the kitchen and join show. Meow, 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 meow. If I around with my hair a lot today, it's because I'm having a bad hair day. So you're just gonna have to deal with it. America. America Ferreira, longtime <laughs> fan of our videos and star of Ugly Betty. <laughs> so, this is a Trader Joe's video. What is it we Trader Joe's trying today, Kristen? <laughs> are you okay? Yes. Yeah. What are we trying today, Kristen? Today we're trying every Trader Joe's soup. Of which there are... 21? 21. We believe there are 21 soups, but if there aren't 21, Kelly, how many it's are there? It's this many! It's this many! Amazing. This was the number that we would have gotten had we taken 45 seconds and counted our soups. Do but that. we don't, and that's the Kitchen and Join promise. Cheers! Cheers! We'll never count. We'll never count. Question. What? <laughs> so here's the thing, we left off the bone broths. Yeah, there's just too many of them and, and they all look the same. That's also, the same. we're not doing any of the like canned soups. This is all their heat and serve soups. So we are gonna start with a delightful option, which is the butternut squash soup. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. So this soup had a broken seal. So we are not gonna be trying the butternut squash. Cool, great, great, cool. We're trying. We're off to a really good start. We decided we're gonna try it. The seal was not broken, I just fucked it up. Yeah, I was just like, I don't think it's broken. I heard it snap off. We're gonna pop this poopy in the micro poop. Look at that delicious color of the soup. Don't, okay, so this is precipitous. Oh, if you spill it on the ground, then the cats eat it. If the cats eat it, then we go to the vet. If we go to the vet, then we can't be on set. And then we can't finish this video. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe to us. We love you. Pretty Very thick soup, surprisingly. It's well, it's, it's kind of a bisque. It would be really good with like a grilled cheese, obviously. You know what? What we're going to do is we're going to be in a pattern where we're waiting for it to heat up and then we're going to have to wait for it to cool down. And then we're going to have to repeat that 21 times. OK, ready? Here we go. It's hot. I don't want to burn my tongue. I need it for things. Special things, like eating. I don't do anything with my tongue. <laughs> anyway. Okay, I'm gonna eat the soup. soup. <laughs> oh. Okay, so there's soup everywhere. It's kind of bland. It's sort of- You do taste the squash though. <laughs> I almost inhaled the squash. Have you ever licked a squash? Like really licked a squash? And you got the memory of what the squash tasted like 30 years ago. Yeah. This is this soup. Butternut squash soup, final verdict? I think it's just okay because I'm very picky when it comes to my soup. As of the shooting of this video. My car is dying. She's really sad. It's not great timing. We're both going through a lot right now. <laughs> so if these videos seem like a little bit more unhinged, it's because we're over- We are. Overcompensating. <laughs> and it's going just, just okay. okay. Is the organic organic creamy tomato soup. So, should we take a shot? <laughs> the soup? No. <laughs> not of the soup. Can I shake it? Nope. If you're not gonna do a good job, but you're not gonna let me do a better job, then like, what are we doing here? The channel. <laughs> <laughs> How is it creamy? Is there dairy in this? Hmm. That is cold. Mm. <laughs> that is really good though. Here's the thing though, it's cold and it's still delicious. This is mm. the best tomato soup I've ever had from That's like a That's delicious. Store. Here's the thing, it is ice ass cold and I'm still like warm ass hot in my mouth. Organic right? creamy tomato soup, really great. What's the next? Squirt, squirt. <laughs> I don't want a soup facial. <laughs> well, no one does, it just happened. Next is the organic split pea soup. This is not gonna be good. Yeah, it might be. Does it have ham in it? What? Split pea soup often has ham in it. It's vegan. Oh. I'm just gonna mentally check out until the next soup. Do you need help? I don't help it. Thanks, Kristen, you're the best. Oh, this doesn't smell great. I know it doesn't smell great. You know why? Cause it's peas. Oh, ow. Oh my God, please be careful the rug. Oh my God, what the, f why? Okay, did you not shake it first? Just mix it. Why does mine look like an unholy mess and yours looks like watery? Hey, let's give it a little tasty tood. I don't want this. Mm. Oh, whoa, this is interesting. Try it. Define interesting. Kind of smoky. There's flavor there. Honestly, like, it's got a little bit of, like, there's a hardiness to it that it's, I appreciate. It's like if they liquefied Oscar the Grouch. If there put, is a meat taste in this. It might be a ham flavoring. There's something meaty about if it. If you put bacon in this, it would be better. So, pretty good. I think it's, it's just okay. It's just okay. <laughs> just okay. <laughs> During this video, Kristen will be the one microwaving the soup, and I will be the dyke that is useless in the chair. <laughs> Wait. Did you just say that you will be the dyke who's useless in the chair? That's my turn to be useless in a chair. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not useless. You've never, you've never been useless in a chair. The Latin style black bean soup. Yummy. Oh, why is it this color? Because it's black bean soup. Oh yeah, you're right. Don't be a 
about the soup. I'm not gonna be a d about the soup. You yeah. literally. We go right away. Uh, Kelly, we're sorry. Kelly. Kelly. Sometimes when mommy and mommy are really, really upset, they yell at each other a lot. My car died. <laughs> And I'm feeling cunty. Uh, yes. <laughs> I love how we're talking to Kelly, but really we're talking to everyone. Everyone. Ooh, yeah, you can really smell the beans. The serving suggestion seems to imply that it's better with sour cream, which we don't have, so we'll just have to pretend. I like, could see how it would be good with sour cream. Black beans. Oh, woo! Ooh, a little bit of kick on the back end. Yeah. I go like, taste the Chipotle. This soup is like that person you invite to the party who's really quiet until like the last 20 minutes when they're drunk and they're like, funny, funny joke, joke. And then you're like, this guy. <laughs> That's what the soup is like. So pretty good? Yeah, I think it's pretty good. Pretty good. Wow, okay. That said, do sour cream. What are we eating? <laughs> it's broccoli cheddar soup. Does it say unexpected broccoli cheddar soup? What would you expect in its place? <laughs> <laughs> How would soup be unexpected? I mean, I guess soup is unexpected if you're expecting like money. It's unexpectedly hard to open. <laughs> to provide you the utmost in tamper evidence. We use a film that needs to be cut open with a knife. That was anticlimactic. Mmm, <laughs> this soup sure gets hit the spot in a cold winter's day. <laughs> okay, so I watched you do that bit. It happened like in slow motion for me. Do I have some cheddar on my face? Um, stop biting your lip. No. I'm on board. This is good. Oh, that's delicious. It's cheesy, but it's not super heavy. There's a lot of vegetables in it. There's a lot of depth to the flavor. It's yeah. not just cheese. There's yeah. like some umami. You can tell the broth was worked on. It is unexpected and that you don't expect it to be this good. Yeah. Trader Joe's, will you just pay us, please? Come on. It's like, <laughs> come on. What do we gotta do? What do we gotta do? What do we gotta do to get your money? The unexpected broccoli cheddar soup. Really great. Really great. Really wow. great. Wow. Damn, I don't know if it's gonna be possible to beat this. I expected it to be a mess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. I guess it is still a mess. <laughs> Please let me not get soup on this dress. I've already gotten makeup on this dress. Do you want to change dresses? No! Okay. The Trader Joe's Harvest Chili. Is harvest another word for vegetarian? They say harvest because it's, it's vegan. Like... Vegan! Megan! So. Ah! Sorry, it was really hot. There's quinoa in this. Oh God. I can see it. I can see the quinoa. I can see the wa. I think it's a little bland. I don't like the wateriness of it. It's not a soup. It's not a sauce. It's not a stew. Yeah. It's a chili. And when you treat a chili like it's a soup, it behaves like one. And that's confusing for all of us. <laughs> it's a pretty good vegetable soup. Texture wise. Maybe one of the worst chilies I've ever had. Yeah. If you go into this and you just kind of like delete the word chili from your mind and you're like, harvest. Okay. And then like you <laughs> eat it that way, then you will be satisfied. Yeah, palatable. But please don't, don't pretend this is not a Chili. Kristen, I'm gonna tell you something my father said to me a long time ago. You cannot be two people at once. You better decide who you wanna be. And if you're gonna wear those clothes, you better wear them well. So this is a chili. He has decided who he wants to be. How is he performing at being a chili? Well, as a chili, I would say it's just okay. But as a vegetable soup, it's quite good! This is a similar soup. This is the organic tomato and roasted red pepper soup. I have a confession. Yes. This is my favorite soup, Trader Joe's. I already know what I think she is. And I also have a confession. I can't open this. I already know what I think the soup is. It's really great. It's, yeah. about, it's the best of Trader Joe's. It's, it's creamy, it's tomato-y. It is the king. It's good with sandwiches. It's good on its own. It's good with friends. I'm still eating it. Wow, the Trader Joe's tomato and roasted red pepper soup. Really great. It's so weird to get full off soup because you really feel like you haven't used your teeth at all, but your tummy is full. I know, it's just like your teeth are just like, what about me? And your tummy's just like, we didn't need you. And <laughs> the teeth go on a journey of the soul. It's the garden vegetable soup. If this is worse than the harvest chili, I'm gonna laugh really hard. Cause it's like, you already have a perfectly good vegetable soup. Call it a chili for some reason. Well, vegetable soup. It's really, it looks, is it too hot to eat? No, but it is not that good to eat. <laughs> <laughs> the trailer for this movie seems really compelling. I'm really I would give it a shot. <laughs> okay. It feels oversalted to me. I think it's delicious. I really am not enjoying this at all, but I also just don't really love like vegetable soups that much. Actually, it's very bright, the flavors. The vegetables are not too mushy. They're distinct from each other. They play as a team, but no one single player is more important than the whole. Yeah. And that's what's important when it comes to soup. I could defer to you on this one. Vegetable soup. She's pretty, pretty good. good. The Trader Joe's hearty minestrone soup. Minestrone! Minestrone! Can I shake her? Oh. How do we feel about soups? Do we like soups? I like soup. I think soup is good. I like soup. I tend to get more into soups when they're sort of like a side dish or as an appetizer. Oh, I assume. I'm not as into a soup as a main meal unless it's like a very like mm. rich filling, like Asian soup. Well, None of those white soups. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, are you saying that my white soups are not as good in feeling also you spit all over me? I'll just rub it in. Sorry. The minestrone has a scent. Suburban oh. Illinois lunch about this minestrone. It's better than I thought it would be though. Maybe not by much. It's just okay. That should not be 
in it. Why does it have peas this in it? This is weird. No, 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 no. It's pound box bad. It has peas in it. The kettle cooked chicken soup. Kettle cooked chicken soup. It's cooked in a kettle where your tea goes. Oh. I think like for chicken noodle soup, just being like classic Americana, I don't think it's very interesting soup. I think that like chicken does not have enough fat in it. I think that we should be eating, honestly, turkey noodle soup. We should be eating things with like more dark meat or we should just be eating ramen, honestly. I think chicken noodle soup is just an inferior soup. It's bad and I discriminate against it. And I'm not sorry. How do you feel about chicken noodle soup? Oh, I like it a lot. Okay. As far as chicken noodle soup goes, this one has a great smell right off the bat. Okay. Ugh. Oh, I gotta get the hair out of my face. Oh my god, dude, this is really good. Really? Mm-hmm. This is pretty good. It's undersalted, in my opinion. Yeah, I feel like it probably would benefit from a little bit of salt, but generally speaking, there's a lot of chicken, there's a lot of veggies. I think it's perfectly cromulent. I think it's fine. I feel like if this were like chicken noodle soup with matzo balls, oh, that fuck. would elevate it. Like okay. chicken noodle soup on its own just needs something to elevate it. Chicken noodle soup with matzo balls is a whole other <sighs> type mm -hmm. of soup. It is the superior soup. It is one of the best soups you could possibly make. It's incredible. Yeah, I would say chicken soup with matzo balls, really great. What we're eating right now? It's not that. It's just okay. It's just okay. It's just okay. The lentil soup with ancient grains. Ancient grains? The hell no, that was ancient what that grain? Mean? Does that indicate which grains are ancient? How did they verify that? Yeah, I mean, do they like <laughs> fucking carbon date those? Yeah. It just kind of looks like beans. Pretty lentily. It's pretty heavy on the ancient grains and not so heavy on the soup. All right, try the lightest, Fine, the lentils. <laughs> Why are there carrots in here? This is nine cents. This is like if they sold baked beans at Anthropology. <laughs> they would. It would be like these like tiny little things. Ancient grains. <laughs> I think lentils are actually like a really great way to like make something heartier, but this is really bland. You can't just slap the word ancient on it and expect it to get in this mouth unless you have money. Yeah, how rich is this ancient soup? <laughs> I think it's just okay. It's just okay. Just okay, we're not f***ing this soup. We're not, we're not gonna f*** that soup. The spicy pozole verde. Okay, it's vegan. Obviously, we are not the arbiters as to whether or not this is authentic. No. We're just mouths. Two crazy mouths trying to find their way in this world. The sound of the soup being poured into the bowl. Sorry, sounds Kelly. Files. So this is supposed to be spicy. Oh. I love it when it soups are introduced to me as supposed to be spicy and possibly tasty. There's a lot of water There's here. There's a lot of onions in a this lot soup. Of onions. It is incredibly oniony. Yeah, it's kind of an onion bath. Let's see. Let's see what's going on here. It is not spicy at all, but... Yes, it is. No, it's not. What? Are we eating the same soup? I don't want to hurt your feelings. <laughs> it's not like too spicy, but there is like a little kick to it. Maybe. I'm so confused. <laughs> Soup is definitely has some spice to it. No? Maybe dig dig from the bottom. I taste like chilies, but I don't really, it's not spicy. There's no heat. Are you eating like these parts? Yes! There's a pepper in my spoon. You can see it. Okay. I don't want to hurt your feelings. <laughs> I'm not saying that it's intolerable or like it, that it's painful. I'm just saying it's there. Yeah. I think, I believe you taste it. Okay, that said, it's not very good. <laughs> It's like spice water. It's just okay. <laughs> the creamy corn and roasted pepper soup. Interesting. The last so the last roasted pepper soup we had was quite delicious. I'm not saying that this one's gonna be delicious. If this isn't hot, I am taking you to jail. It's a creamy corn soup. <laughs> it's really hot. It's boiling. Ooh, you just dive in there and I kind of need a second. Yeah, I burned my tongue. Yeah. That is an interesting soup. I'm not really quite sure what to make of that. It's certainly creamy. You can taste the dairy. It's like if somebody spread a bunch of butter on an ice cube and then heated it up. And then they smeared like just like a, little, a little bit, bit of, of squash. Yeah. Oh, there's supposed to be squash in that? It's corn. Oh, it's corn. <laughs> it tastes like corn, but it's not good. Some things don't need to be liquid. Me, you, hoops, this soup. The creamy corn roasted pepper soup, just, just okay. Just okay, but like, don't eat it. <laughs> you can heat up an ice cube and some butter at home. Corn poblano chowder. Ooh. I am afraid. I'm a little skeptical. Listen, no offense to the earth, but the thing about when a chowder comes in a box, it's just like, some things just shouldn't be boxed. First of all, did you shake it? Yeah. Is that a lie? Yeah. Like if we were wound the foot. <laughs> oh, sorry, I gotta take this. Hey, <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Millionaire. Yeah, here. It doesn't matter if you did, I got a hot new investment daddy. A hot new investment <laughs> daddy. Here's the thing about a chowder. When the chowder has the consistency of a soup, it's like, mm, it gives me pause. This is not a chowder, this is just a corn soup. And we already had a corn soup. This is awful. This is the worst soup we've had today. This is the soup equivalent of being invited to your friend's improv show for five years. <laughs> and it says on the box, comedy. And yet when you open it, it's not. It's nomedy. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is belly box bad. Yeah. The miso ginger broth. I really like miso. I love miso soup. I really want this to be good. I mean, I it's it pretty hard to screw up, but you'd be surprised. 
Mm. Oh god. <laughs> I gotta wash this now. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. I was just like, what is happening to my body? The ginger is pungent. I can I smell, smell ginger. I can, the ginger's here. It's fine. Yeah. I think it's not salty enough, I don't think. No, that's actually a big point. Yeah, it's yeah. a little bit bland mm -hmm. and the ginger's a little overpowering. It's but sort of like soup you eat, like if you're sick, you just kind of need to get some fluids in your body and it's like, uh, Yeah, this is totally palatable. Yeah, it's just okay. I've had better miso soup. This is the chicken noodle soup with veggies. Ooh, with veggies. I'm yeah. souped out. No one wants to be souped in. I appreciate when the noodles are a fun shape. Spiral. Anxiety spiral. All right, let's take a little bite. Mm. Oh, that is so incredibly under seasoned. This is much worse than the other one. This is much more bland. It's the box. Yeah, I don't know, maybe the box like saps the flavor. It's awful. There's no salt. Mm, when I want a soup, I think about something that has no seasoning. I want to taste like there's like water in my mouth, but hot. This is so bad, it's like making me not very funny anymore. This is penalty box bad. See. Instant ramen soup. So Trader Joe's had three flavors of instant ramen. They had spicy miso, chicken flavor, and miso. Miso. So we decided we're gonna try them all at once. So yeah. Why do you look so disturbed? It's like, I was like, how do I do Dad? that? Dad? <laughs> Karen? <laughs> oh, fuck, she's dead. Oh. We have successfully made all of the instant ramen. I mean, we think. What? <laughs> okay, I. <laughs> What happened? It's really hot. Ow. Well, that's what you get for being good at your job. <laughs> okay. I'm okay. gonna try the, just the miso flavor. So not the spicy miso. Okay. Broth is okay. Mm. Broth is decent. Honestly, I like that broth better than the miso ginger broth. Yes. I'm concerned about these noodles though. Really hot. Mm. <laughs> My glass <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> So we're just gonna hold that feelings in our heads. We're gonna try the chicken flavor. How am I supposed to hold these feelings in this head? Whoa. Okay, the chicken flavor is salty as hell. Hell yeah. Hit me up, baby. All right, I'm gonna try the spicy miso. Oh my God, so hot. I wish they did like a miso chicken. I think that as far as the miso flavor goes, chicken is the best, plain miso is the second place, spicy miso is third place. Oh my God, I'm the exact opposite. Really? Actually, not really. I think, <laughs> I think the miso is the best, and then the spicy miso and the chicken. Now the chicken was too salty for me. Honestly, I almost want to combine all three. I want to see them together. I feel like they're stronger. These are like the Spice Girls. They're much stronger together than they are apart. Our critique of the Trader Joe's instant ramen. Pretty good! Pretty good! Pretty good! Pretty good. I thought these were our last items. I was wrong. Yeah, she was wrong. Cause I was just like, What's this? And it turns out that we left one behind. We have a soup we have not tried. I honestly don't think it's that exciting though. <laughs> the tomato feta, it's tomato and cheese together, finally. Ooh, I like this texture. It is thicker than the other tomato soups. She's beautiful. When the soup already comes preloaded with cellulite, I know it should be good. Mm hmm This is delicious. I knew you would like this it. This is really good. It is really good. I'm honestly so relieved that it's good. It's tomato and feta. We've had a rough day. We, we are sober. We've done no shots this video. We did no shots this video, so we are severe. This is delicious. I think this is really great. Mm. And I would say as far as soups goes, Trader Joe's, I was a little bit disappointed in some of their output, but I really do appreciate the wide variety of options. I think that there were some standout soups. The unexpected broccoli and cheese soup, which like, I don't know why it was unexpected. It was unexpected though, because we did not expect we to did love it as much. Yeah, we expected it to be very good. Yeah. I think obviously the roasted red pepper tomato soup, yeah. always, always a winner. I think some of the bottom ones were the split pea soup, all the corn soups. My personal favorite was this video because we both looked really good in it. Someone's done with the video now. I would like you to drive me home because my car is broken. <laughs> <laughs> See ya! <laughs> Come on! I can't go back! But seriously, bye, we love you. <laughs>